The Atari Creep YouTube channel is intended for a mature audience. Regardless of the subject matter, this video may contain strong language, simulated violence, and psychological nudity. Viewer discretion is advised. What's up, Creepers and Geekers Chris, the Atari Creep. How is everyone doing today? September 1st. You know what that means to me? Fall is right around the corner, and I fucking love fall. It's my favorite time of the year, not just because of Halloween, but because football season starts. I absolutely love watching the Patriots play. I'm not a, I'm not a fan in the way that like my father was. So in a weird way, I'm going to dedicate this video to him because he was an enormous. Well, he was a sports fan. Period. But football was his jam. I mean, he, he talked about playing football, and every week the TV was, uh, was um, taken hostage by him. And every football game that could be on was on. <laughs> he had the radio going. This guy absolutely and it was like the one vice he really truly had. So let's dedicate this one to him by taking a look at a Tommy Pocket game based off of the very sport we're talking about. This is called Touchdown. Um, there's really not much information on the machine itself. And yeah, I'll call it a machine. It's got gears in it, okay? Um, but down here it just says Tommy Taiwan, where a lot of them would have a date. Usually around 77 is where these things were made. Uh, some of them in the 80s. Uh, I, I don't have a date on this one, so I'm sorry about that. But here's your here's your instructions if you want to pause and, and have a look at it. Now, there is a scoring system, and we'll get to that in a minute. But if you look at the key here, um, if you play the game and you get 20 to 40 points, you suck. It says try again. You don't get nothing. Uh, anything from 50 to 60 points is not bad. Uh, 70 to 90 points. Nice technique, and of course, 100 points is the goal. Touchdown. You're the winner. Okay. So, game's really simple. There's a, a spring and a gear system inside here. It's pretty amazing how they got these things to work without batteries and all that. No electricity. Perfect for a long trip. And this is one of those games where you can play for quite a bit, you know? It, it'll hold your attention a lot longer than some others. Um, but it's really simple. This arm <clears throat> gets dropped down using this thing here. As long as this is in the stop mode, this bar will not move. Once you release it, the bar slowly rises to the top. You do have a little metal disc here with a, a football sticker onto it, which is kind of hard to see. But it's there, I promise you. And uh, simply, you got to try to get the ball up to the end zone without it falling in any of the holes. As a matter of fact... This would be a perfect fucking E.T. game. <laughs> E.T. 2600. You know what? I may find a fucking junk version of this. Sand it down, buff out, buff out the plastic, and relabel it. And re <laughs> That's actually a really good project. I don't know if I'll ever do that, but fuck it. So let's play some football. Let's see how well I can do it. And the, the great thing about this game is... Yeah, there's skill involved, but sometimes it just happens, you know what I mean? And other times you can't make it happen at all. So let's see what we can make happen. Um, I'm going to hold it at slightly of an angle because I like that better. Uh, but you know, let's, see, let's see if we can't get a touchdown at least once. So I'm going to have to straddle over the stupid camera. So let's see what we got going on. Here. Let's start the ball here. Oh, come on, get out, get out, get out. Nope. So I got 50 points there. So uh, what did they say that was? 50 points is not bad. Yeah, it's bad. But at least we got a little bit of a run on that one. You know what I mean? All right, so let's do this. Let's start on this side. Hopefully I'm in frame here. Oh, yeah, I suppose you have to start the game, right? It's like, hey, the guy's reviewing something. Don't even know how to use the thing. Come on. Oh, same spot. Go way over here. Go way over here. Come on. Come on. Come on. No, get over. Damn it. 70 points. 70 points. All right, let me put it on a stop this time. There we go. All right, one last try. One last try. I bet you we can do it this time. I bet you we get it this time. Oh, come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Touchdown. There we go. And that's it. That's a uh, touchdown. Tommy pocket game. This one, I remember this one holding my attention for quite a bit when I was a kid. Um, it was one of my favorite ones. I do remember it also being 
labeled as other games as well besides football. I just can't remember what. So if you look it up, I'm pretty sure you can find it. There's a whole treasure trove of these pocket games. Um relabeling the same game over and over again. Uh, but they, they were there's just this a charm and some kind of a, a quality of these things that I absolutely love. No batteries, real simple gears and mechanisms to make it work. And it's fun and it's charming and um yeah, I really think there should be one of these themed like the ET2600 game. So guys, go ahead and let me know what you think down in the comments below. Do you have this one? Have you had this one? Do you remember? Do you not give two shits about football? Either way, leave your feedback, thumbs up. Ooh, thumbs down, all feedback too. The creep is positive. Uh, the tripod is on top of my new Skeletor figure. My girlfriend found one of the ones from the new show. Um, you know, here, I'll show it to you. I'll show it to you. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba. You know, I don't care what you say. I like the new show. But either way, guys, I hope you're doing well. Happy 1st of September. I was going to say happy Monday, but it's Wednesday. <laughs> the girls started school today. And, um... It's an exciting time, so I hope you're all doing well. Thank you always so much for watching. And until next time, take care, creep it real, and bye-bye.